Hello everyone, welcome to Electronics Workshop. Today in this video, we are going to interface MLX90614 non-contact infrared temperature sensor with Arduino. This is our first video on MLX90614 infrared temperature sensor. So we will try to make it very simple. In this project, we will connect MLX90614 infrared temperature sensor with Arduino and display the temperature reading in our serial monitor of Arduino IDE. And in the coming videos, we will perform different advanced IoT based projects using this non-contact temperature sensor. Do you want professional PCBs like this one that looks so good then use the services of PCBWay.com. You can select the board size any solder max color that you want including something like red, green and black. You can also select the thickness and the PCB can be from 2 layer to 32 layer for some more complex design. The finished quality is also so good and the ordering process is so easy. Just go to pcbway.com and quit now. Insert your design setting, upload your Gerber file and order now and receive your PCB in couple of days. Before starting the connection, we will see the features and hardware interface of MLX90614 infrared temperature sensor. Some of the features of MLX90614 infrared thermometer are single and dual zone versions, customizable PWM output for continuous reading, measurement resolution of 0.02 degree centigrade, small size and low cost, factory calibrated in wide temperature range, available in 3 volt and 5 volt versions, easy to integrate, High accuracy of 0.5 degree centigrade over a wide temperature range. Now let me talk about the hardware overview of this sensor. The Melix MLX90614 module is centered around the MLX90614 or non-contact infrared temperature sensor with the exceptional accuracy. Unlike many temperature sensors, this sensor does not require physical contact to measure the temperature. This is particularly advantageous for temperature monitoring of moving objects such as rotating motor shaft or items on a conveyor belt. By aiming the sensor at the target, it can detect the temperature by observing the infrared waves it emits. The MLX90614 sensor comes equipped with an optical filter that blocks visible and near infrared light, minimizing their impact on temperature measurements. Additionally, this filter provides protection against interference from ambient light and sunlight. Now we will talk about block diagram of MLX90614 sensor. The MLX90614 has an internal state machine that controls the measurement and calculation of both object and ambient temperatures. The sensor can support two infrared sensors but only one is implemented in the MLX90614XAX. The output of the sensor is amplified by a low noise, low offset chopper amplifier with programmable gain and then converted by a sigma delta modulator into a single bit stream. The signal is then processed by programmable FIR and IIR low pass filters to achieve the desired noise performance and refresh rate. The output of the IIR filter is the measurement result and is available in the internal RAM. Now it's time to describe about the working principle. The MLX90614 is an infrared temperature sensor that can measure the temperature without contact with the object being measured. It works based on the Stefan Boltzmann principle which states that all the objects emit infrared radiation that is proportional to their temperature. The sensor uses a thermopile detector to collect the infrared radiation in its field of view 
which can differ depending on the specific version of the sensor being used. The analog signals collected by the thermopile are then processed by an application specific signal processing unit, which filters and amplifies the signals. The resulting digital signal is then transmitted through the I2C bus to a microcontroller for further analysis and use. Pin configuration of MLX90614. It has total 4 pins which are as follows. The first one is BIN pin which is positive power supply pin. The second one is ground pin which is reference potential pin. The third one is SCL pin which is open drain serial clock pin and I2C line clock pulses pin for data synchronization. The final one is SDA pin which is open drain serial data pin and I2C line to communicate data to the host MCU. We have discussed in detail about MLX90614 temperature sensor. Now we will interface this infrared temperature sensor with Arduino which is also the main part of this project. To connect the MLX90614 module to an Arduino, first connect the BIN pin of the module to 3V3 pin of Arduino. Next connect the GND pin to common ground. Then connect the SCL pin of module to I2C pin of the Arduino board which is A5 in our case. And finally connect SDA pin of the module to I2C data pin of Arduino board which is A4 in our Arduino nano board. After completing the connections, it's time to upload the code to our Arduino board. But before uploading the code, we must add MLX90614 library to Arduino IDE. There are multiple libraries available for the MLX90614 sensor. But for our example, we will be using the Adafruit library. This library is straightforward to use but it only provides basic temperature measurements and does not support the advanced features of the sensor. To download the library, you can go to the Arduino IDE library manager which can be accessed through the sketch menu. From there, click on include library and then manage libraries. This will prompt the library manager to download the library index and update the list of installed libraries. Filter your source by typing MLX90614, click on the enter and then select the latest version and install. The following is a simple Arduino code that enables you to test the functionality of the MLX90614 sensor. You can get the link of this project in the description of this video. By clicking on that link, you will be directed to the project. Now scroll below and look for source code and programming section. Copy the given code and paste the code in your Arduino ID. After uploading the sketch to your Arduino, open the serial monitor and ensure the baud rate is set to 9600 BPS. Once you have done that, you will start receiving the real-time readings of both the ambient and object temperatures on the serial monitor. If you want to know further more detail about this project, you can go through the link given in the description below. It contains the full documentation about MLX90614 sensor including the Garver file of MLX90614 module. In the bill of materials section of this project, I have included all the components detail along with the Amazon and AliExpress link so that you can easily order the components and perform this project by yourself.